You can still visit the Gilchrist Museum while it's under construction, but this time in a different way. The museum is taking the artwork to you at 31 places around the Tulsa area. News on 6's Meredith McCown tells us about Gilchrist in your neighborhood. This piece of art is at 30 other places, and at each one, you can scan QR codes to learn more information and to make this painting come to life. It's like a treasure trove across the Tulsa metro with this painting at dozens of locations, like Kendall Whittier Square, Guthrie Green, and the Tulsa Zoo. People voted this summer on three favorite paintings to be displayed, each one for a few months at a time. You can see the painting forest scene without having to visit a museum. The art is displayed both indoors and outdoors, and you can read a description about the piece. When the sites are live tomorrow, this QR code will activate an augmented reality experience to bring the art to life. You'll find this painting across town until mid-January. We're coming out to the community and bringing the artwork to people where they're at, and some people might not have been able to come to Gilcrease before, so this is a really exciting time where we can bring the art to them and hopefully build some relationships so that when the museum does open up, they can come to the museum and feel really welcome. A forest festival is happening at Central Library on Sunday afternoon to celebrate the artwork. It's free to attend with several different activities for kids and families. The Gilcrease Museum is expected to reopen in 2024. In Tulsa, Meredith McCown, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.